That's her full name. <laughs> full name. If she gets a driver's license, proper <laughs> identification, she'll need a full name. A lot to spell. First, first middle and yeah. last. Of yeah. course, everyone needs that. You got it. How are you? June Gloom, I guess, decided, you know. To take, take a break. break. Yeah, well. yeah, I know. It's really lovely. And in fact, we're going to see June Gloom kind of hold off a little bit for us. We're just going to end up seeing mostly sunny skies and temperatures above average for the next seven days. Today, a few of those thin clouds decided to stream on in overhead. We are going to notice them decreasing, though, and ending up with just sunny skies, at least for us tomorrow, and that's really going to allow temperatures to warm up rather nicely. Currently, we are dealing about 66 degrees for us. Mostly cloudy skies. Winds right now about 8 miles per hour. They are forecasted, though, to go about 10 to 15 tomorrow along the coast and inland areas, possibly up to around 20 for the mountain community. So a little bit breezy, a little windy in some locations at time as we await the arrival of this trough. Now, that's what's provided us with that little bit of cloud coverage. It's going to begin to kick on out, and with it, we'll end up noticing uh, sunny skies by the afternoon after we see about a 10% chance of drizzle throughout the early morning hours. Going to be happening while you're sleeping, though you might not even notice it. And then we'll just look for temperatures about one to two degrees warmer for tomorrow. We're talking about very minor warm up, but it is going to be above average and simply delightful out there. Quick look out into the tropics. This is tropical depression 2E forecasted, though, to regain some strength. And right now, tropical storm warnings are up from uh, Salina Cruz all the way out over toward the Guatemala border, where they're anticipating about 10 to 20 inches of rainfall. Isolated amounts on up to 30 inches of rainfall in some of those local mountains there forecasted to become a tropical storm tomorrow as it impacts land. For us, we're just talking about the winds not associated with that system. But turning breezy by the time we get to around 11 a.m., 13 miles per hour free out over toward Del Mar around 10 into Alpine. Peaking, though, at around 1 to 2 o'clock, up to around 14 in San Diego Poway. It'll be around 14 miles per hour then as well. They should die down right around sunset at about 7 o'clock. And then we'll see the winds return for us as we head on in through about Wednesday, 2 o'clock yet again, up to about 15 miles per hour in San Diego and 14 in Oceanside. But that wind, it is ushering in the warmth, and it is also pulling in a lot of sunshine. 70 forecast for you, 74 degrees for the next two days. We'll We'll notice our temperatures uh, pretty much staying flat that all the way for the next seven days. Inland 84 degrees, 85 on Wednesday, beautiful sunny skies with a little breeze. The mountains 81 degrees on Tuesday, 80 on Wednesday. The desert's looking at 104. It will be a little bit windy for you, but not happening until later on into the afternoon. That's a look at your 70 forecast, guys. Back to you. It'll be hot in that desert. <laughs> Thank yeah. you, Sabrina.